Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you a let's play of my low level Cyrus getting the heavy solar trans and that's the JX. So the place you need to go to is the Dark Citadel and I was showing it there on the map and the way to get the Dark Citadel to appear is to complete the Plains of Koroth with Issa and once she's completed that quest by defeating Zalsara, then both Drems Moor and the Dark Citadel appear on the map. So that's where you'll need to go, Dark Citadel. You don't need to complete Drems Moor first, you can go straight after Plains of Koroth to Dark Citadel and you play it with Cyrus. And the other thing you need is the map of the sacrifice and I'm showing it here, I'd already bought it with this low level character it's around a couple of thousand chips, I, I don't remember the exact amount now and you'll see that it showed a face in a room and it's a statue face and on the floor so I'll show you getting it later in this video but I thought I'd do it as a let's play I have actually got a video on the map of the sacrifice but I still often get asked how do you get Cyrus's heavy solar trans and I think because in the title of the video it's talking about the map and not the solar trans so people don't know to look at that video <laughs> for how to get it so that's why I decided to remake it as a video about getting the solar trans so it's quite clear in the title and so that it's not the same I thought I'd do it as a let's play so you can see me playing through the Dark Citadel and it's particularly great at the moment with the spectrum attack gem <laughs> lots of rainbows and hearts and it's much more solid color than when you use it in the solar trans so it's much brighter play. I really like it. It was one of my favorite things about IB2 actually so I'm really enjoying using it in this game and I'm happy I got it with both of my characters the high and the low level character and I'm, I keep being asked can it be upgraded well it's very unlikely that it can be and Chair said to me that they hadn't tried out every combination but every one that they did try it didn't work so they wonder if we will find something out but it is unlikely that it can be upgraded but that's okay because you know the amazing visual effects it's worth it for that <laughs> for me anyway and I know quite a few others who also feel the same so you know just because it can't be upgraded doesn't make it any less amazing so I've got my spectrum attack gem equipped in my heavy weapons and because it's low level I tend to stick with heavy weapons they are the best for low level character because of the higher attack and okay you have to do directional blocking get the right direction but you know for the extra attack it's worth learning that and the beauty about the solar trans is that they amplify the attack of any element gem you equip in them and I get asked about that saying the solar trans only does 10 attack but that's before you've put the element gem in and it doesn't matter which element it is and dark fire or spectrum attack gem it will enhance the attack and the higher you level the solar trans the more attack it will give you so you know by my high level characters stage it's getting heaps more attack and I have got videos on the solar trans at higher levels so if you want to know what attack they give then check it out so I'm defeating this Titan in Alsar's lair here and after this Titan is defeated this is where you need to look to find the heavy solar trance. So I'm going to open that chest first 
and then you look to the left and you'll see that statue's head on the ground and you tap the statue's head it's on the left there and you get the heavy solar trance and here it is you see it the JX and it's got two square gem slots and as I said 10 attack but there you go once you add in your spectrum attack gem or any element gem it adds 5400 to any element attack gem at that level so my 1000 spectrum attack shot up to 6400 and you know if you've got a 10 element attack gem it will be 5410 you know it adds a heat so as a bonus i thought i'd show you my fight with alsar and basically he didn't stand a chance <laughs> because he's low level and my spectrum attack gem in that jx just tore through him really fast so <laughs> He was down with my first attack break, and that's with a low level character. So it's a really great weapon to have for your low level characters. I recommend grabbing that map and then grabbing the Solar Trans JX. So I hope you've enjoyed this Let's Play, and I wish all of you, my subscribers and viewers, a great Happy New Year for 2016. See you next year. Thanks for watching Tamil Channel, your favourite channel for Infinity Blade. If you enjoyed the video, please like, comment and subscribe and check out my website and social pages. Thanks, see you next time.